Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use transcribe in Microsoft Word so that you can record spoken word and have that transcribed into text in your Word document. Let's check it out. Okay, so here I am at office.com, the Microsoft 365 home page. Now, all I need to do is launch a new Microsoft Word document, and I can either do that by going to Create, I can go to Word document here, or I can go ahead and click on the Microsoft Word app. Let's do that, and let's create a blank Word document. Okay, so here I am in the new document. I'm gonna go ahead and go up here and name it School of Rock Lecture. And in this scenario, it's a class at Brian Sensei's School of Rock. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And so I'll need to put today's date here on my document. And now I can either take notes as I listen to the lecture, or I can save myself time by having it transcribed. That's right. Here's how you transcribe. You're gonna come up here to dictate, and we're gonna click the dropdown, and we're gonna choose transcribe. Okay, when you do this, you get some options first. Notice that the default here for me is English, but let's say the lecture was in another language. I can change that and select the language that's being spoken. Now notice here, you can either upload an existing audio file or you can start recording now. This is nice because maybe you pre-recorded a lecture and you wanna bring it into Word, you can then upload it here and have it transcribed. In this case, I'm listening to the lecture in real time, so I will click Start Recording. However, I need to check my microphone before I start the recording. Now up here in my browser, I'm in Microsoft Edge, I have the little microphone icon, I'll click here. First, you wanna make sure that you're allowing your browser to use the microphone. Then you're gonna click on Manage. And here you wanna make sure you have the correct microphone selected. In my case, I have several, so I need to click this and select the Yeti microphone. All right, so now I'm ready to go. Let's close that and let's come here and click on Start Recording. Good morning, class. In today's lecture, we're going to learn about the emergence of punk rock in the mid-1970s. Okay, so when I'm done, I'm gonna click Save and Transcribe Now. We'll see here that the audio file is being uploaded to my OneDrive, and we can see here that it even broke the recording into segments, and we can see the transcription of what was said. The nice thing about this is I can be selective about what I want to add to my document. Maybe I don't want to add all of this. Maybe I just want to go through and add specific parts of the lecture. But down here at the very bottom, I can add to document. So if I click here, I actually have four choices. Just add the text, include speakers, include timestamps, or include both speakers and timestamps. Let's use this fourth option and see what it looks like. All right, so what we have here is it inserted the audio file into my document. So I could click this and actually listen to the playback, but I also have the transcript here. Boom shakalaka. No way. That is so punk rock. Now I'm doing this in Microsoft Word Online, but please also know that you can use this in the desktop version of Microsoft Word. If you liked this video, please let me know in the comments below. Also, if you want to see more of these videos, consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification button so you can be notified every time I post new videos. It doesn't cost you anything to do this, and it will help me keep my channel going. Also, if you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please let me know by completing the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.